on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 432 pounds, the world tag team champions, Dean Malenko and Chris Ben Watt. We're just moments away from this huge tag team match, guys. And I don't think I've ever seen these four superstars more motivated than they appear to be heading into this one, Michael. Combined weight of 393 pounds, Terry Boy and Rick Todd O, the Blue Bloods. Byron, how big is this match for these two teams here tonight? Well, Michael, the tag team division is white hot right now. So while a win will obviously be huge, I can tell you that a loss would be absolutely devastating. Given the competition right now, a loss tonight would be a huge setback. Everyone's ready, and oh, just man. like that, this tag team match is underway. Harsh impact. Oh, what impact. Oh! <laughs> There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. Nicely done. But I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable. Here he goes. This just ain't gonna do it. He's starting to feel it here. Headed it. He fights his way free. But how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? This might be it. Oh, my. He's taking some offense. He may have to start reevaluating his game plan. Well, it's not dire consequences for him here, which is good. But just in case, he might want to think about getting his partner in there for a bit. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Man, mark my words. He might have it. Is he done? Whoa, he gets out of it. He's at another level right now, Michael. In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. The rivalry between these women got so intense that Naomi was in Flair and Lynch's corner and Tamina was in Natalya and Carmella's corner. The cutter never ceases to amaze me. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. 
Natalia's power set the tone for the match and gave her team an advantage. That was until Carmella's overconfidence let the Irish last kicker turn the tide and get back into the match. And then it was elementary from there for the Irish-born superstar. Naomi did an excellent job of making sure any quote-unquote committee nonsense cost her girls the match. Once Becky Lynch got Carmella locked in the disarmor, there was nothing for the Staten Island Princess to do but to tap out. And it didn't take long for that to happen. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, count. Look out, look out! This could be it! Oh boy, he is rolling! In a standard tag team match, one competitor... They can't walk after that attack to the back! Now that's how you make a statement. Uh, yeah, there's no way this match isn't over after that one. Now that's a display of excellent ring awareness. Nicely done. Going for the big one. Oh, what a cross face. Now that's what I call making a statement. Hey, what goes up must come down. And we have our winners. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. And this is how he ended it. Here are your winners, Dean Malenko and Chris Ben Watts. Nice teamwork by these two here tonight. These two work so well together, Michael. I'd be surprised if they went their separate ways anytime soon. We've got an animated crowd here tonight as we usually do when we're in Orlando.